Okay. Hey guys, good morning if you're in California. Good afternoon if you're on the East Coast with me. Hey guys, I am so happy that you have decided to take the opportunity to spend a few moments to get healthy with me. This means so much. It makes my heart so happy. Thank you for having me too. Thank you. Oh, thank I, you, I am, you. I am honored. I am honored to have you. Uh, we had a, a, a very, very yes. uh, good uh, show prep and uh, got a good chance to, to get to know you and talk with you a little bit. Uh, as I pivot over here to your page, I'm going to ask you this. There's a posting that you had. Uh, there's a number of them, but there, I'm going to start with this one. You have a posting that says, the skin you are in speaks volumes before you part your lip. Get to know it, nurture it. Absolutely love it. The skin that we're in speaks volume. What what can you say to the audience that you had in mind that you want people to remember with that posting? I want people to remember that your appearance is everything and how you present yourself is everything. And when you absolutely love the skin you're in it shows before you even part your lips you know when we're walking around it's the energy you carry even when you think no one's watching it's very important and we pay so much attention to how we look but it's all about how you feel because how you feel it's going to project how you look and that's really important to me um really i can I can tell you this. I've come to recognize from your page. Tell everybody your page so they can go to it right now if they want to, so yes. that they can like, comment, share, follow you. What is your page, Lisa? My page is Chapter 50 Motivator. And, guys, I would so welcome you and so appreciate the follow. And I hope you will find something there that encourages you or inspires you. That's the most important thing, to be inspired along the way. You know, life is so heavy, so it makes a difference when you find someone, something to inspire you. So Chapter 50 Motivator, health coaching at its best. There you go. I, I want you to know that uh, you're getting some love back on the screen. Uh, double dot theory, oh, yeah. double underscore dot hey, underscore theory. Dot says, theory. Uh, they're checking in from California, giving you some love. So I'm going to ask you this. So that you can tell the audience. Now, look at the screen. Watch okay. me for a second. Right behind me, there's a sign on my monitor that says huge news. So everybody, Lisa has some news about, well, what do you have going on that others can be a part of that you are promoting? Well, right now, I am so happy to promote. I have a new ebook that's out. And it's so important to me because my ebook really talks about how to change your mindset, you know, healthier lifestyle, healthier lifestyle with your emotional health, that nutritional health, and most important, your physical health. I have a freebie on my page. It's my Get Fit Workbook because although I'm not a fitness trainer, Fitness is a huge part of my journey because I believe strongly, you know, I am a nurse, certified nurse practitioner of 20 years, so I believe wow. it very imperative to move. You know, even, you know, before I started this journey, I did not realize how we take for granted just to move, to get up throughout your day-to-day, -to, -day, to walk to your mailbox, expand those lungs. Do whatever you can just to get some movement in there. So I am so proud to share my ebook. I have a book within a book with my ebook that talks about that strategic eating. You know, it all goes back to what you're putting on those lips. So these things are very important when dealing with your healthier lifestyle, the mindset, the emotional health, the nutritional health, the physical health, and lastly, that spiritual health. Show that gratitude every day, and I'm so thankful for each and every one of you for the support. You know, this journey is not easy out here. Mm -mm. <laughs> yeah, you, you've been able uh, to um, leap over a number of different things that have come your way to be where yeah. you are now. I want you to take us back for a moment and tell us what it was like a year ago. What was you it know, like a year today ago? Today is my one year anniversary of doing this. <laughs> You know, a year ago today, you know, we were all quarantined. Uh, 
wasn't able to go into my nursing homes because I do nursing home rounds okay. every day. And we were doing a lot of telehealth. And in the mornings, you know, you, you could not contact the nurses because they're busy passing their meds. So the afternoon is when I scheduled a lot of my telehealth visits. So I would be out exercising because I just, I did not like being inside. And I said, you know, there's someone that needs me. And I have a, a special friend that encouraged me, you know, you should really take this to social media. And I'm like, but I just, I did not have the self-confidence. I'm like, I don't know what I'm doing. You know, everybody looks just so fabulous. You know, they're all glammed up and they know what they're doing. And they, a special friend really encouraged me, just, just give it a try. And at that time, I really wasn't sure of myself. And, you know, my confidence has grown over these last 12 months. Awesome. And I met a wonderful business coach, Mecca Joy of MJ Biz Consulting. And she has really been not only my coach, my mentor, but a friend who has really encouraged me to step out of my comfort zone, to be myself, to really show myself, my personality, yeah. my energy, because that's what it's about for me. I go into my nursing homes, you know, I see so many, you know, patients that they don't even know they're in this world. And I'm like, we have to live and appreciate each and every day. So that's what was most imperative to me to take this journey, you know, to ride this storm out. I feel like I've been called to do this and the inspiration that I have been touched by so many women over these last 12 months has been the overwhelming feeling that it has given me. It has been just truly unbelievable. Because before embarking on this journey, I'm going to be honest with you. I never realized how many broken and men, I will get to you later, but I never mm -hmm. realized how many broken women wow. go through day-to-day -day suffering with obesity, chronic illnesses, the back pain, the uncontrolled yeah. hypertension that they don't even talk about because they wow. are busy being caregivers for their families, going to work, being grandmothers, being pillars of their community. And I was so happy that I was able, and I'm able to provide a safe haven, a support system, somewhere that they can come and release these health concerns, these health issues. I never realized how many women had not been to a doctor, had not been to get their yearly physicals, their screenings, because of insurance, because of barriers of not knowing where to go. So to be that voice and really encourage them, it has given me a joy that I just, I can't describe. And it has been so overwhelmingly just brings me joy each and every day to make a difference in someone's life. And that's what it's all about. Wow. You know, of course, we, you know, we want the huge following. We want people to know our name like I want to be a household name I want to be a brand that you can identify with you know at 50 years old I decided to step out of my comfort zone you know with this world of you know all these millennials running around here doing their thing yes indeed honey yes, oh my goodness and she is because oh. I believe you know across the lifespan we all are struggling with yeah. some kind of situation that we're not comfortable talking about. So I am just so happy to to be there for I target my women over forty, but honey, I talk to all women and I <laughs> you <laughs> feel and look your absolute best. So yeah. to feel to and feel look and look your, your absolute, absolute best. best. I because don't know Lisa. Wait Lisa. Wait wait time out time out. Time out for a second, Lisa. Time out for a second. I gotta tell you this right now. You might have to hashtag and make a hashtag and make a T-shirt out of that. Okay. To abso absolutely look and feel your best. No, no. That's no. no how how feel. we? Do, how's it go? Absolutely feel because feel. you have to feel it. You have to absolutely feel. feel. Absolutely oh, that's good. Feel. You have to feel it. It all. And this is something I identify with my health coaching clients. This is why I love okay. my one-on-one -on -one health coaching. It all goes back to the feeling. How did you make me feel? Like you welcomed me coming on this podcast with you. 
I will remember that feeling. That's something I can take away. You know, it's not about what you look like. It's how you made me feel. And that's why I tell everybody, when you feel it, you can own it. And oh, you can yeah. look yeah. your absolute best. That's what's important. How does something, someone, some situation make you feel? You're going to remember that. You might forget what they look like, but you're going to remember how something or someone made how you they feel. made you feel. Mm -hmm. One of the greatest joys that I had in doing a show prep with you yeah. was that there is no variation to who yeah. you are. Who I am. You love you love learning, you love growing, yes. and you love sharing, and you love yes. watching others yes. bloom. Yes, you you oh that's you a thousand percent. And I I yes. I, I want you to, I, I want you to do me a favor. I want you to do me a favor. What was it like being in your comfort zone? and then leaving it when you were in a comfort zone a year ago and then you left it describe that for somebody who may be in one right now because i'm gonna tell you right now on the screen i'm looking at a monitor over here the pantyhose barber okay. uh, the, uh, that that person is online and they're throwing blessings your way and they yeah. talk about they love your energy yeah so so listen people are going to get motivated by you Yes, they're going to get motivated. Tell Probably. them tell them what it's like to move away from a comfort zone and what that felt like for you and what emotions you went through doing that. You know what? And I still go through something every day. Every day, you know, I ride this wave of roller coaster because you always want to be politically correct. And even, you know, this morning, I'm going to use this morning as an example. You know, I posted a reel about my one year, you know, a year ago. Yes. You know, I saw that. I was and, mm -hmm. you know, I, I used the song Justin Bieber because I love the beat. I love the energy of the song. It just <laughs> makes me want to move. Get your peaches out in Georgia. When my <laughs> uncle called me and said, do you realize, do oh, you Lord. realize, that first slide looks like you're naked. I'm not that not naked, but I did. Now, you'll never see me show my butt on here because I don't feel like I have to show my butt. But I showed them, you know, uh, hey, I'm embracing me at 50 because we feel like, you know, we're afraid to come out of our shell and what our bodies look like. And, you know, that is really a scary thing to show yourself on social media. You don't know. It causes anxiety. It causes my heart to palpitate. But I'm like, some woman needs me because her obesity that she's dealing with, we all have been at a size we didn't like. But I just want to encourage women, embrace where you are and do something about it because it's up to you. And I just, I can't encourage people enough that what's going to work for Johnny down the street is not going to work for Susie because we all have different lifestyles and we all have different things that we are struggling with as individuals. And I think the biggest thing for me is just, you know, we compare ourselves to others. And the biggest thing for me, because a lot of people still tell me to this day, oh, Instagram is not the right platform for you. You're 50 years old. It's a bunch of young women. But, honey, it's a lot of our young women out here struggling, middle-aged yes. women, absolutely women, where absolutely my voice can be heard. That's where my platform yeah. is. And I have been more than pleased with this Instagram platform because of the feedback and the love that I have felt from all women across the lifespan. So yeah. Now, yeah, now tell yeah. me, now tell me something. Now here we go. I'm gonna okay. do this with you, and you, you're gonna help everybody out. I know you are. So I'm gonna read it, and then you go ahead and break it down some more. Okay. Okay. Here we, here we go. When they, this is an inspiration post that you put together. When they don't see, when they don't see your value. When they don't see your value. They will never understand your worth. Your, worth, your yeah. value starts with you. Tell us and more that, about that. And that post is so deep on so many levels because every day we encounter situations, individuals, male, female, where we just don't see ourselves in the highest light possible. And when you don't see yourself in the highest light possible, when you don't value yourself, that comes across to other people. 
you know, we have to display confidence. And even if you don't know the answer to something, it's okay to say, I don't know, but I'm willing to learn it and go look it up. But when we walk around with low self-confidence and not valuing who we are, you know, it comes across and people are not going to see your worth and they're not going to appreciate what you can bring to the table because I am sorry, at the end of the day, it all comes back to how are you going to impact me and what difference can you make in my life today? And that's what is so important. And if you're not able to make a difference, we need to look at ourselves and say, why? Why am I not making a difference? Why, you know, am I not being valued? Well, first I need to look inside and see how do I value myself and what do I see myself bringing to the table? And I think that self-worth is everything because no one else, and this is why it goes back to those feelings, no one else can tell you how to feel about yourself. Be in control of your day. Take control of your life. And that's why it's so important to live a healthier lifestyle because when you feel good, it doesn't matter. It does not matter. When you feel it, it's going to be displayed. And your self-worth is everything. And that's what's important. When yeah. you find uh, others here through your motivation and inspiration as a motivator, a lifestyle motivator is truly what you are a health motivator. You continue to touch people's lives. Mm -hmm. What would you like to tell someone right now who may not understand that there are steps that they need to make, whether it be losing belly fat, whether maybe they're trying to uh, make changes in their, their choice of food. Uh, you talk about all these things on your page. A and number the, and of the things. Biggest thing what is one, before you go on, what is one two, maybe three steps that they need to maybe take away from meeting you today. Maybe three things that they need to take away. Please, what encouragement can you give in three steps? And those big three steps are mindset. You know that mind is a powerful thing. And that's why you have to take control and change your mindset on how you look at things. Number two is to get your physical health together because I don't care if you don't have a penny in your pocket. When you have mm -hmm. your health, you have wealth because I have seen the richest of the rich not even able to breathe because they did mm -hmm. not take care of themselves. Mm -hmm. You know, you don't realize, you know, your cardiovascular system, your respiratory system, your renal system, it all goes back to taking control of your health. And if I can't encourage you to do anything else, when you're in the Publix, the grocery store, know your blood pressure. Know what your blood pressure runs. Write these things down. Get a baseline weight. Get, oh my gosh, this is so important. Mm -hmm. Develop a relationship. That number three thing is to develop a relationship with a significant health care provider. Don't wait till something happens. And if I can't stress to you the importance of just getting to know your body, know when things are not right, because when you know that things are not right, you will take action. It's when you ignore them. That late intervention, it's too late. When you identify these things early, it's the implementation that makes all the difference in the world. And it all starts with that mindset. Yeah. So don't, don't procrastinate. Don't put it off because... The health is it, but it's triggered is by it. the mindset or led by the mindset is what you're it's, saying? Is that what it's you led? It's led all by your mindset because your mind can tell you, oh, that's not my blood pressure that's bothering me with that headache today. Oh, I'm not going to do anything about this. I mean, I, I have a young lady right now in one of my nursing homes, 62 years old. She had a headache. Vision became blurred ran around all day picking up her grandkids, but in the back of her mind, she just kept saying, oh, this is just a regular headache. She talked herself out of going to the ER. Well, now she's paralyzed from the waist down because she had a mm. stroke. In her oh, mind, wow. her mindset told her, don't take care of you. Go pick up those grandkids. And guess what? Those grandkids, you think they're at her bedside now? 
you know who's having to find her a gospel radio station to listen to? The nurses. So once you change your mindset that I'm going to take control of me, I love my family, I love my kids, my husband, my grandkids, right. my aunts, my uncles, right. my neighbors. I love them all dearly. But until I change my mindset to take care of me and to take control of my health, I'm not yeah. going to live a healthier lifestyle, and it all starts with you. So the number one takeaway today is take control of your life, your health. Do what makes you happy. If you have to dance around <laughs> in the floor <laughs> to change your mindset, honey, do it, do it, do it. And that was oh part my of me goodness. leaving my comfort zone because, honey, I love to dance. I love to just enjoy yes. life and you know i'm like people are not gonna like my energy people are not gonna like me and i had to get away from that and say you know what who's ever gonna like me gonna like me and who's not <laughs> unfollow and go on because this is what i am yes indeed mm. yes, oh indeed. man i gotta give you one it it is there it is all about because the world has too much negativity out here. Yes, 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 yes. It yes. does. So we have to find a way to be happy. Because when you harbor those negative thoughts, negative feelings, it comes with anxiety. It comes with panic attacks. It comes with stress. That leaves your blood pressure up. That leads to hypertension. That leads to uncontrolled diabetes. That leads to bipolar disorder. It's so many things that a negative mindset can affect the lead to negative health. And it goes back to those positive lifestyle, healthy behaviors. It does. It really does. And that's what you I have, truly believe in because that's what I live by every day. You have, uh, you have um, well, I'll just read it. You have this to say. Uh, in one of the captions, you, you write this, self-worth and self-value play important roles in how you see and treat yourself in your everyday life. Yeah. Learn how to utilize both. Your words and your actions are your true value to you. Once this is established, your worth goes unspoken. Yeah. Explore your values to become a healthier you. And you know what that all boils down to? What's that? Be you. Stop bullcrapping people. Because you know that's a mm. lot going on out here. And show up and do what you are supposed to do. Your actions <laughs> go unspoken, honestly. And, and that's across the board. When your actions go unspoken, your worth goes up. People want you. They want to see what you have to offer. They want to be around you. But don't be a sourpuss finding negativity <laughs> or not showing up. If you say you're going to do something, do it. Come Amen through. to that. Do Amen to that. Wait, hold on. Wait, hold on a second. No, hold on a second. I got to give you one. Of yeah, if they don't show up, that's what they get. But I'm going to take Thank you for saying that. People got to show up. Keep their word, right? Very good. Very good. I love that. Listen, we... Are gonna have to go because oh, uh, okay. I, I listen. No, 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 no. Listen, please tell everybody again. The sign behind me is huge news. This is a huge news Tuesday because yes. I want you to repeat what what do you have going on on your page again? Your ebook and everything. Please tell everybody again. Okay, guys, so you can find me. Check me out. Come hang out with me. Positive energy, positive vibes, healthier lifestyle, healthier lifestyle choices. And we talk about a whole plethora of things. But I have my one-on-one -on -one health coaching sessions. I have my ebook. I have my Get Fit Workbook. Guys, I have a wonderful funnel. You can come on and get a consultation with me. 15 minutes free, we talk, to see if we're right fit for each other. Because, you know, honey, sometimes they say I might just be a little too much for you. But, honey, I love to let it bring out the special value that you have in you. Oh, because we all have it. Mm -hmm. Yes, indeed, honey. We all have it. We just have to bring it out and let it shine through. Step out of that comfort zone. But click on my link, guys, because I would love to have you follow me, hang out and join me with my one-on-one -on -one health coaching. You would absolutely love it, and we'll get you right, because that's what I do, boo. <laughs>
I have enjoyed myself. Yay. I have been waiting to do this with you Yay. again. You had people online saying that they love your Yay. energy. There were tons I of parts it. flowing across the screen as we were Yay. doing this. Uh, you are someone that yeah. others need to connect with. I'm so glad you said yes to come on to the show. I've been waiting yeah. to have you on. No, I get people that write to me yeah. all the time, and they want to find someone just like you. So they oh, told me to go yeah. look for someone like you, and I oh, found you. I am so oh, happy. So uh, I am grateful. I am grateful for this opportunity. You don't know what this means to me. And this is so special because you know what? It's the feeling. This is my one-year anniversary of when I stepped out on my comfort level. And look at what I'm doing. Yeah, Daddy. I know. Yeah, when when I saw the posting, wait, I saw the posting. I went like, oh, this is perfect yeah. timing, the one-year anniversary. Uh, listen, yes. um, on the screen, I look like same, same, love the energy. Uh, double yeah. underscore dot underscore theory says that. Uh, you're getting applause across the screen. Yes. Let me say this to you, okay, before we okay. have to go. Listen. You are a black 50-year-old woman. Yeah. I see that, that, that you post that on, on your, on your yeah. thing. But you cross all type of beautiful color lines because yeah. as a woman, I yeah. respect you, uh, irregardless of, of, skin, of the beauty of the skin. One yeah. thing is for sure, you are comfortable in your own skin and yeah. you're able to motivate others to feel yeah. comfortable in theirs. I needed you on the show to Thank be the one you. to say that, because when I say it as a man, it means one thing. Yeah. And I can say that to my, my two adult daughters, it means yeah. one thing. But to yeah. social media, yeah. I am glad that you are a voice to be reckoned with in the Thank future you. as well as right now. You are a beautiful oh, person, yeah. Lisa, Thank no matter you. where you are. But I know yeah. you're in Clearwater, right? Yeah. You're out there yeah. in Clearwater, yeah. out there in Florida. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Okay, so we'll share some more energy from Florida over here to California. Yeah. We'll do this again another time. But right now, enjoy the yeah. rest of your day. Thank you for being right. you. Stay Thank awesome. You. You. And everybody right. else, don't right. forget, we have a show tomorrow. Okay. Uh, we're going to have the uh, beautiful Alisa from Becoming Alisa on. Uh, we have a, a jazz musician. Uh, okay. She's going to be on. Uh, her name is uh, Kacha. Uh, did I just mess that up there? Uh, there it is over there. Kacha. I'm reading my copy across here. So that will be on Narc Abuse underscore TV network. Lisa. Go find Lisa. She is at Chapter 50 Motivator. Motivator. Chapter 50 Motivator. Like, yeah, comment, yeah, share, follow yeah, her follow. page. If you don't, you're yeah. wasting your time. Click yeah. into and tap into her energy. Thank you very All much, right. my friend. I appreciate All it. Right. Everybody else, we'll see you soon. All right. Thank Take you. care. Bye thank for now. You. Bye bye. Bye bye.